Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some whip shots. These are, it's vodka infused whipped cream. It sounds really cool. Uh, we have the vanilla caramel mocha. Uh, pumpkin spice lime and peppermint. These uh, six flavors were the only ones that we saw. We bought all of these at a store called Total Wine. They do have the full size of the mocha and the caramel, they, so they're the same size, but we're thinking uh, we don't even know we if we're going to like them or not, and we didn't need them, so why spend the money? Because I'm going to tell you the difference in price. The, um, the peppermint... And the peppermint, lime, and vanilla were, uh, uh, were four, no, yeah, were $13.99. $13.99 for peppermint, lime, and vanilla. The pumpkin was $14.99. I don't know why it was a dollar more, but it was. Then the small ones were only $6.49. So, of course, they don't have as much in them, so. Right, but that's okay, because we just, you know, we want to try If you're buying it, you want to. Do it as a drink, then you know, probably won't buy a bigger one. So, the big thing the something that you need to know, and they make sure that you know, is you do not refrigerate these. So, it even said it on um, like it says it on here, but it says do not refrigerate right there. But it even had a like a piece of paper on the shelf in front of it that said yeah. do not put these. In. So, something must happen. And it says, remember, do not refrigerate. Yeah, something must happen if you put them in the refrigerator. So I'm assuming that means even after you've opened it and everything. Yeah. Okay. What does that say right here? That's too small for me. Best if stored between 56 and 75 degrees okay. Fahrenheit. Okay, so we're going to do the vanilla first. Ultra. Well, we're gonna, well we can. As we say, do you want to shake all of them first or you just want to no, do them? No, I think we should do them one at a time. Uh, ultra, it says vanilla, ultra premium vodka with natural and artificial flavors and caramel coloring. It has 10% alcohol by volume. It's 200 milliliters. It, you have to be 21 years old to buy this. It contains alcohol. We did try to go in uh, Meyer and find these. They were out. We went in... Um, We've been in Kroger, they didn't have them. Kroger didn't have them. No, Kroger oh. didn't have them at all. And Kevin asked somebody in there, and she said, "You have to go to. You need to go to a liquor Good store to get them." So uh, we have a local uh, liquor store called the Liquor Barn. They had three, three flights, right? So to get, they didn't have any of the specials. They just had the, the basic ones, right? So it was really nice to be able to go in Total Wine and get mm -hmm. all of them. That was really nice. Okay, so it says do not refrigerate, da uh, non-dairy, gluten-free. Um, there's a government warning on here. According to the Surgeon General, women should not drink alcoholic beverages during pregnancy because of the risk of birth defects. Consumption of alcoholic beverages impairs your ability to drive a car or operate machinery and may cause health problems. Um, produced by Temperance, temperance Distilling. In, in uh, uh, I don't. It looks like Michigan, maybe. Uh, Whipshots.com, StarcoBrands.com. Okay, so the directions on here. It says Whipshots Whip It Lux with an effortlessly smooth blend of vanilla and ultra premium vodka. Directions. Slap it, turn it upside down, and give it a few slaps. Here, let me read one of these while you do it to this one. Okay. Okay. Slap it. Turn it upside down and slap it until you feel your whip shots drop. And then... I never felt anything. See, I thought... I was thinking you just had to slap it one good time. Is this slap it until... Slap it until you feel it I never felt anything. And then what? Shake it? Shake it. Keep it upside down. Shake it up and down until you hear your whip shots go fluid. It's fluid. Okay, and now it, yeah, now it says whip it. Remove cap, turn all the way upside down, and press the nozzle at an angle. Well, here we go. It says for best performance. Now, this is a little bitty letter of things. For best performance, run warm water over the bottom of the can prior to shaking. Well, it's. I wonder little, if it's something that knocks loose. I don't know, going. but it's a little bit too late so now. Dry. Does it feel normal? 
Hmm. Okay. Now you you. Woo. Up. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Turn up. You don't want to get too much of it. It's strong. It does have a vanilla flavor. Wow, the vodka's strong. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> it, it tastes okay. I can imagine putting that on top of a thing about a hot cocoa with a little bit of that on top. Yes, a hot toddy. Um, I actually really like that. Yeah, nice flavor. Um, it has a really nice vanilla flavor. Mm -hmm. um, it tastes like a pure vanilla. Mm -hmm. So, with um, yeah, with. <laughs> and you yeah. definitely get the alcohol. Yeah, oh, yeah, you get the vodka, but I mean, it tastes <coughs> like. It tastes like the good vanilla. Yeah. So yeah. you can get cheaper vanilla and you can get really nice quality vanilla. That tastes like a really nice yeah. quality vanilla to me. Yeah, so we good. didn't have to run the water over it. That's good. No. Well, let, let's see if the little ones work the same. It's, it has the exact same directions. I, I felt it fall. You did? The first one must have already been loose. That's why. Oh, okay. You can do that one. I will. Once we're done with this, I'll do this one. I'm afraid to do it too early. I'm, I'm assuming. And what I'll do is at, at the end of the video, when uh, I'll take a, I'll put some out on a plate for you, and I, I'll take a picture, and that way you can see what it looks like. But I don't want to put it out on a plate now because it'll just melt. Did you mess it up? Did it not come out? It did. I got some. Turn it straight up and down though. Okay, this, right is, an angle. this is caramel. Okay. Mm -mm. It stopped, didn't it? Mm -hmm. You messed it up. I didn't mess it up. There's just, it just wasn't, doesn't work. It's like it doesn't, it didn't get all the. Ooh. It's got a good flavor to it. But yeah, see, there's no liquid anymore. It's like that's all there was in that For little $6.49? $6 yeah, it's like that was it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Well, you won't be getting a picture of that. No, there's nothing. There. You know what though? It tastes like, um, it it's tastes, like it tastes like coffee. It doesn't taste like caramel to me. Let me try this one. Mm -hmm. Okay. So slap it. Turn it upside down. It says slap it and then it slap it, turn it upside down and give it a few slaps. Oh, okay. So turn it upside down. That's what it always says. Turn it okay. Upside down and slap it. Okay. You feel something fall? Heck, I don't know. You you would feel it. I think I did. Okay. And then now I'll shake it. Keep it upside down and shake it. It's definitely liquid. Yeah. That uh, the caramel though, it tasted like coffee. Mm -hmm. It didn't it taste did. like caramel, but it tasted like coffee, and I really didn't get a lot of the vodka. Uh, no, there is some, but it, it wasn't really. Strong. I think the the that coffee flavor. You do the rest. I think that coffee flavor flavor covered it up. Yeah, now, let me do this first, because yeah. if we yeah, if it runs mocha, out. That's basically what it did to me. It, it basically, it ran out. I was like, no. Uh, hmm. It tastes like mocha. Yeah, those don't get these. Is that, was that it? That's it. Okay. Don't get the small ones. They don't suck. get the small ones. <laughs> yes, I would not get the small ones. Yes, they're not gonna give you the same the satisfaction as no. the big one. Definitely I like the, not. What little I got of that was good chocolate. It was good, yes. It, it Yes, it tasted like chocolate. You really, out of those three we've had so far, the only one I really tasted the vodka in strong was the yeah, vanilla. Yeah. The other ones, the flavors were strong enough to cover it up, mm -hmm. uh, but I like them all. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. You wanna do that one, see if you can feel it. Okay. Drop so that. I turn it That's over. It Smack it. Oh, oh, it did it. You can feel it kind of. Boom. Yes, it did yeah, it. Now shake it. it. Yeah. I liquid. feel like I'm in the movie Cocktail. Yeah, it's liquid. Okay. With Tom Cruise. Okay, so this is Pumpkin, Pumpkin Spice. Spice. Yeah, those work better. Mm hmm. I love that pumpkin spice. It, um, it's very strong. Um, I think that's delicious. That can it's, you it's imagine that on your pumpkin, pie, pumpkin pie? I mean, why not? If you can, here, kids. <laughs> here, you rowdy kids. Kids don't want pumpkin pie anyway. No. If you can, though, no, why that would not? be good. I, I think, I think that'd good. be good on your pumpkin spice latte or your hot cocoa. Yes. Like I said, I'm thinking hot cocoa or something. Yeah. No. No. I totally agree. But that is. It has that. Uh, classic 
pumpkin spice mm -hmm. flavor. Yeah, but you definitely get the alcohol too, though. You do get a little bit of the vodka, but I still think the pumpkin spice is stronger than the vodka. It is. The pumpkin spice is pretty strong. You know what I mean? Sure. I don't know if I, I didn't feel a distinct. Oh, it, yeah, I did. It falls yeah, from the, it's like glued or stuck to the top, the bottom of it. When you turn it upside down, it falls in there. You're supposed okay. to turn it upside down. You shake it. Oh, was I supposed to shake it upside down? Yeah. Oh, I flipped it over. It's okay. I think it's fine. One too many steps for me. <laughs> Just had a little vodka now, too. No. no. There's not enough. No, the, no, I don't think there's enough. Now, lime is uh, going to be interesting. Oh, lime. Uh, for some reason, I was thinking it was going to be key lime. <laughs> she fills her all mouth up. <laughs> Don't you? No. Oh. Okay. You're oh, squirting, squirting everywhere. Um, that is like a. Um, I've never had like people do those shots, those Jello shots. And I don't know what they normally would put in a Jello shot because I've never had one. But that would that seems like lime Jello. Mm -hmm. So if you if you've ever had a lime Jello vodka shot, that's what it would seem yeah, like to that's me. That's what it seems like. Mm -hmm. It's really it, it goes. It's very there, strong really lime, and and it does taste like lime Jello. And it's a little much for me, but it's funny that we that I brought up Jello uh, because that's what when we buy whipped cream uh, to have on a dessert, that's what we put it on a mm -hmm. lot is Jello. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Um, okay, last one. Okay, last one. Let me see if I can do it right this time. Turn it over. Slap it. Just make yeah. It. Just shake it like yeah, upside down. It sounds liquid. I don't know what they're expecting for the liquidy part. It's liquid. Okay. Now you open it. And this one is peppermint. These, of course, don't have any calories on them. Now you know they have calories. You would think so. I wonder if we were going to think that tastes like the same thing. I don't know. I think it tastes like Tootsie Roll. Really? Mm -hmm. I don't get Tootsie Roll. I get a peppermint Tootsie Roll. Oh. It's, it's okay. It tastes like peppermint and that Tootsie Roll chocolate flavor to me. Yeah, I can see that, that aftertaste. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, I, I do not mind that at all. Yeah. I, that's probably my least favorite. Uh, my least favorite is probably the lime. Honestly. Oh, really? No, my least favorite is probably the caramel because it tasted like a really like a burnt flavor. But I didn't... I got a lot of it and you didn't get much of it. Yeah, you couldn't get a lot of it. I, I'm, I, that's the only thing is so if you're going to get I don't these, know that any of these are really going to last very long. It might be just very I quick. I know. I know because those were gone so fast. That, I mean, you saw we did it right. Um, so, yeah, for for $13.99 or $14.99, that's the thing is, is, is you're probably only going to be able to use this a couple times and then it's going to be gone. Mm -hmm. But I definitely would not get the little ones. I would go ahead. I do like these flavors. I like both of them. But I would get them both in the big can. Yeah, just get the big ones. These are the ones that uh, the liquor bar had. I would think these are the three that most liquor stores would have. These three weren't even listed on their website. So, oh, huh. Remember, I looked for them and it was like. You said, yeah, you them. said they weren't there. Yeah, because mm -hmm. Kevin looked, because we were on our way from one place to the other. We were just making sure we had all the flavors. Yeah, and I said, I want to make sure we try them all because I didn't know what uh, flavors they had out. Um, I, I truly, I think these are cool. They I have really their do. place. If you I have like a, them. If you have a place to put them, like a different drink or something you want to put some of this mm -hmm. on. I mean, putting it in your mouth and just eating it, I don't think it's practical. But if you had a drink. It was fun, though. It was fun. <laughs> but if you have like a something um, you want to put them on, I think it would be really cool. If, if you like to, to sit around like Kevin and I and just try different things. Yeah. Um, 
Then, yeah, just uh, get the big one so you have better luck. I know I have a friend that has sent me some Instagram pictures of a party they have every year on his birthday where they do uh, food reviews just like we do. Um, and I dearly love those pictures. But they need to do this. Uh, they they need to, to review these. I mean, why not? Unless they don't drink. Unless they don't drink. Because this would be the perfect thing to like sit around and pass this around and uh, try it. I just think it's a lot of fun. So my, what is your favorite? And then I'll tell you my favorite. I like the, the is it the mocha one? I like the mocha. I actually like the vanilla one probably the best. I'm thinking about what I would want on other things, like mm. a hot cocoa or something. Right. Probably the vanilla or the mocha. Um, I'm gonna say these three basic ones. I can understand why the stores sell these. Uh, the three basic, the caramel, mocha, and vanilla, those are my favorite too. But then if I had to pick a specialty flavor, um, I would go for the pumpkin, the pumpkin. spice. That's what I would yeah. do too. Yeah. Pumpkin spice, and then you need to like lime jello for that yeah. one. Or if you're doing jello shots, put that on top of your jello. Wouldn't that be fun? That makes yeah. perfect sense to me. I would totally try that on lime jello. Mm -hmm. I mean, why not? And then the the peppermint's probably my least favorite, but I still wouldn't mind using it. Again, it would probably go really good with hot chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> so you'll have to let us know. Have you heard of these? Yeah. What have did you, you try them? Yeah. What did you put it on? Because uh, yeah, there's lots of different ways these can be used. And did you buy the little can? Because this literally feels empty. Mm -hmm. Like these, you can tell there's some stuff in them. Yeah. These this feels empty. Yeah, so do. yeah. yeah so, there's no weight to them, right? There. No. Whereas this feel, I mean, that's significantly mm -hmm. heavier. And I know it's a bigger can, but I mean, it feels. This feels like an empty can, and you saw we didn't do anything with it so you'll just have to let us know what your experience was uh, but i hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching